Hey everybody and today I'm back with Title Tuesday on Chess.com. Let's have fun and let's start. Hey, I'm back with start. Okay, volume on 70. I don't remember if I'm muting myself here, but I'm definitely I'm pausing here. Uh, yeah, how's everyone doing? I don't know. I don't remember honestly if I muted myself or not, but I, I mean, I think if I keep it on post, it's fine. Anyways, so how is everybody doing? Hopefully you are doing well. Thanks for the prime to Denya uh, three days ago. And also Grey Sensei, Sensei at tier one for one month as well. Thank you very much to Denya and Green Grey Sensei for the subs. So the tournament starts in two minutes and 40 seconds. Uh, already 400 something players, 411 players. So it's going to be interesting. Hey Peter, hello Karmar. Hello Champs to 24. Poof. Already 425 players. Hi guys, how are you doing today? It will be interesting whether we'll start with over 500 players or less than 500 players. Because if I'm not mistaken, last style Tuesdays we, we started much more than with uh, 500 players. And today maybe less people because Granky Chess is going, so Magnus is not gonna play. Rapport wasn't playing, but Kaimer isn't gonna play. Good, that's nice, Karmar. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be interesting to see. 444, I mean, I'm pretty sure we will start with 500 players, but we'll see. <laughs> 450C, but no, it's unlikely, honestly, now. Oh, but maybe it's likely, I don't know. It's a fun game till the tournament starts. 465. Okay, that's that's a big boost and we still have a minute. It is very likely now that I think we, we are gonna hit it. 467, yeah, it is likely. That we'll get it. 471 and 55 seconds left. Close 475. Hey, thanks, Frogger. 4.79, it is very likely, and we still have 40 seconds. 4.83, 17 people in 35 seconds. 4.88, okay, now it's like 99.9%. Four nine one, four nine seven, and 500 players. 5.01, there you go. So, we are starting with over 500 players. It's promising. It's gonna be a very, very interesting tournament. I think everybody I'm going to turn on emote only already since 10 seconds till the start so it's not much time uh, and yeah five four three two one and the tournament begins okay This is unusual, I haven't seen it before. If I'm being honest, usually you play c4 if I'm not mistaken, which I can be. It looks a little bit strange, it's b2 pawn. d6, should I, no, it's not sack a pawn, let's go e5. B4 can be interesting, but then it sounds like queen c7. Ooh. This is an interesting move. When is that? Let's go rook b2. I don't know if it's good. Uh, <laughs> I honestly don't know whether this is good, but it looks like some nice content. Um... Maybe it wasn't a great idea. B6. 
be too impulsive, I don't know. Let's go queen e5. So that queen of 4 isn't possible and gf queen h5. I am an exchange down, but the king is weakish. So it's interesting. Knight to blood check, how are you doing? Bishop f3, I want to go queen h4, f5, queen g5. Something like that with the idea of queen f5. It's interesting. Unusual. <laughs> Definitely unusual chess. It would be true. But I don't know, I didn't want to lose a pawn. Maybe I had something better, but we, we will see if I had something better after the game. Maybe e5 wasn't the best move. Yeah, I don't know. We'll check after the game. But I'm definitely sure that my opponent didn't play the best way with this rook b1 stuff. Rook b3. Interesting. a5. d5. d5. Let's go e5. Queen d6. Maybe bishop a6 to develop the bishop from here. Some a for bishop e2 ideas, I don't know. Oh, but is there a queen e5 just a queen trade? Okay, maybe there was, but you didn't go for it. Uh, Repeat is a bit annoying. <sighs> Gotta play faster. Let's take on e2. Because if take take, I'll have some at least something like knight g4. And if rook b8, bishop f3 or something, or move the knight away. Because, I don't know, bishop f3, there is rook f8, my knight hangs. So yeah, rook b8. The knight is gonna hang. Uh-huh. I'm gonna go bishop c3, take take in g7. Gotta hurry up. That doesn't look great. <laughs> Definitely doesn't look great from the opening I've had. Uh, I think something like this is necessary. Yeah, after the opening, e5 and should be 2 was maybe a bit too impulsive decision, honestly. But still, let's go. Bishop f6, so bishop g5, I suppose. Maybe King G7 would be stronger though. I don't know. Queen E4, uh, Queen E8, I want to go Queen G4 and like King H5. Bishop F3, I don't know. Bishop! <laughs> I want to play bishop f4 there.
is not great. Ay, ay, ay. It's not good. Yeah, that wasn't the best game. I, I had a better... I, I feel like I had a better position from the opening. Uh, but even in the middle game, I think it was somewhat go somewhere good, but probably this queen of three wasn't good. Uh, yeah, not the best start, but okay. I think would be was a bit too impulsive. I thought it was very nice, but I missed this. Uh, I missed this queen before move. I'm pretty sure if not queen before it would be good, but maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, queen before queen of five, it was actually fine. A five was a step in the wrong direction. Then I was lost. Ah, okay, I wasn't even equal. It was plus three all the time. Yeah, that wasn't the best game. Ah, uh, emote only off. Okay, but whatever, it happens. I just want to see... Okay, I thought it was like plus one out of the opening, but Stockfish just gives plus 0 0.2. I thought I'm much better since this uh, Fianchetto Bishop. The pawn on b2 is a weakness, the rook is strong on the open file. Thanks, UBS Apple. Hello, Organ. Um, yeah, queen e5. e5. I missed queen d6, and rook b2 was a bit too impulsive. But I honestly wasn't sure what to play because I didn't want to give away the pawn as well. Stockfish says I should have gave away an exchange. But I should have gave it away on. Uh, I should have taken the bishop instead of rook b2. But okay, if not queen before, it would be fine. Rook b3 would be equal. But yes, I missed queen before, and then it wasn't super good. Uh, she was winning. Then I had some chances after rook b8. Yeah, after rook b8. Bishops. Okay, that's a tricky move. Queen c8, king h8. I sacked the bishop, but I've made. Yep, that wasn't the best game, but GG. Ha. Huh. Okay. This should be a draw. Since the color of promotion dark, and the bishop color of the bishop is light. Okay, draw. Emote only. And the rounds two should begin. Since I think there was the last game playing. And I should play with the white pieces, and I am. Let's go. Maybe let's, I don't know. Let's go e4. Let's try e4. Because last tournament I played knight of c all the time, now let's try e4. See what, what will happen here. And b3. Yeah, he knows the best line. G6 is the best uh, continuation for black after B3 Sicilian. But let's still let's still try. <laughs> I am not sure. Bishop C3 looks interesting, but uh, perhaps I'm gonna take with the pawn and then like queen to e2. And Lonsai Castle. I don't know if this is good. Queen e2, queen c7, c4. Yeah, let's try it. Now Lonsai Castle is the idea to play rook e1 in case I need to protect the pawn. And now maybe some like h4, h5 ideas and something like this. To start the attack in case just in case I can probably even play c4. Okay, I think in b1 is a good move here. Just in case I have c4 if I really need to protect the e5 pawn. Okay, he wants to attack, but 
I want to start attacking first. H4, H5. Hello, Gucci. How are you doing? He wants to mate me as well? But he won't be able to mate me if I'll mate him first, you know? <laughs> so let's try that. H5. I want to open the H file and perhaps mate him on this H file. Hi, future Slower, how are you doing? How are you doing, everybody, today? Hopefully, you are doing well today. I'm gonna take if H is in like Queen E4, Queen H4. Hi, Shogunot, how are you doing, guys? Uh, Queen E4. I mean, okay, if CBCB or AB should work, this is somewhat weak. Knight G5 ideas. Looking spicy. Knight g5, what will he play? I wonder, okay, yes, h6, but then rook h6. Oh no. Ah, maybe yes, something like rook f5. Maybe it's a bit too early to go for it. Uh -uh 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 -uh. But okay, I have knight e6. Rook e5. Rook e5. Do I have anything fancy there? I don't think so, but I think I can play f4, and then knight e6 will be a threat. So let's go knight g5. So rook f5 my ideas f4 with the idea of knight e6 or to take on h7. If bishop e5 knight e6 looks absolutely magnificent. Rook f2 rook h7. Why not? Yeah, queen h4. Queen yeah okay queen h4 rook g5 rook g7 queen g5. Queen f6 ideas, bishop d3. Ah, queen d8. He's in time to bring the queen into play, back into play. Uh huh. Okay, I can play queen d2, maintaining the pressure on the pawn. What else can I play? Let's play queen f4. So you still keep in mind this f6 square. And I protect the e5 pawn, and I also keep in mind hx square if I want to uh, play on the h file. Queen f8. First of all, I'm pretty sure I can take, 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 play bishop d6. And this just looks very, very nice. Because he doesn't have many moves. Should I go for it or not? That's a question though. Bishop b7. Bishop c7. I don't know. Mm. Okay, let's go for it. Maybe I could have won somewhere in the middle game, but I really like this end game with two bishops. He has a lot of weak pawns and all that stuff. So I'm looking forward to play that. Okay, let's play bishop d6. I was thinking g4, but then after knight e5 wasn't great. Uh, bishop e2. Oh no, I think I'm just gonna grab a pawn, because I mean, if, if it's a free pawn, it's a free pawn. Why, why not simply grab it and go like rook f1, plus the d3 square is gonna be available for my bishop. I think this pawn is just just for grab, you know. HS Riddle, how are you doing? Bishop c4, okay, I mean a pawn is a pawn, we all know that. Um, let's go bishop e2, I want to get my bishop here. I'm not sure if it's good because I want to play, if knight e5, I want to play bishop e4, attacking both the knight and the d7 pawn. Uh, check or let's go bishop f3 if knight a5 bishop b4 looks nice here bishop e4 so i can play rook f1 and move the bishop away if necessary let's go back That 
that's just a free night. Yes, I, I feel like I played it a bit, a bit, I don't want to say like carelessly, but ugh, I think I didn't, I, I don't know what it's even the word, but I was very, very close to destroying him in the middle game, but then I gave him chances to get to the end game, and yeah, he was surviving. I was plus five, queen h4, rook g7, that was all good. Queen f4, I gave him a tempo, queen f8 was a mistake. Thanks, Karmar. Thanks, Just Riddle. Hi, Hanson. Welcome to the channel. Yeah, Queen H4. Yeah, I was a bit worried about Knight E5, honestly. Since the pawn is protected, my bishop cannot be open. Thanks, Shogunot. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Computer suggests Queen E4, so I sack the pawn but take the C4 pawn. And after Bishop C4, I take D5, a fork, I sack and C4. I mean, that's a bit, that's a bit deep. I feel like, though, I feel like I maybe had something better after rook f2. I'm not sure, perhaps not. Maybe simply, yes, queen g3, not allowing queen f8 and just destroying him since there is no moves and I can take, take bishop d3. Yeah, queen f4 was in here, so I gave him a tempo. Take, takes. I still didn't lose the advantage completely, but I gave him chances. And rook c4, rook f1, and rook cc was a blunder, and then I just won. But what accuracy did I play with? 85, one brilliant move. A pretty decent game, but I, I, I gave him chances to escape. It wasn't the smoothest win of them all, but a win is a win. So, yeah. I think Bootnik will win this. Mm. Thank you, Jester, you don't appreciate it. Yeah, Bortnik flagged his opponent, but position is honestly unclear. Most likely it's winning. Stockfish finds some nice drawing ideas to get the king to the e file, play rook f6 or rook f7, doesn't really matter, I think. But the idea is that you play rook e6 and e2 is unstoppable. Is stoppable, I mean, you stop e2. But yeah, it was really tough to find in the blitz game, so white just didn't end up finding it and they got flagged, but otherwise the position is pretty much lost. So yeah, it's blitz. Thank you, Gucci. This should be a draw, but I have a feeling... Hold on, what feeling do I have? Bishop c7, bishop c4? I'm honestly not sure what feeling I have and who is playing for a win. Bishop b5? Oi! Why would you play king g2, king g1? I thought probably better was h4, king f4, get this pawn. Because now, now it's simply winning, no? Bishop moves d8, take king g2, king e7, king f3, king f6, yeah, white won. And queen b4 resigns. Now it's a draw, no? I know, Queen before. Thank you so much, Andy, at tier 2 for 65 months. Thank you, how are you doing? Yeah, white did win indeed, but I feel like black were winning if they would go king f4. That's nice, okay, playing with the black pieces. Emote only, guys, almost forgot. Let's not forget emote only, let's talk after the game. And let's hope my opponent plays e4. And uh, d4. I have a feeling here. Play d4. Maybe e4? Oh, e4. Okay. Okay, okay. Ooh. I. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. We didn't agree on that. We agreed for bishop a4. We haven't agreed on bishop c6 and going for this exchanged Rui Lopez. No, 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 no. We didn't agree on that. Or at least I don't recall that we agreed on that. Uh, bishop g4? Bishop g4, e5? Knight e5, knight... Mm, no, I think I'm gonna castle first. Bishop d4 looks really tempting. But this e5 can be annoying. Okay, now he plays h3. Then let's simply develop rook d8 and all that stuff. Then then it wasn't meant to be to play bishop g4. Because I was just worried about e5 and I don't want to spend a minute out of three to uh, calculate whether in some lines I get advantage or I don't. 
excuse it's just not worth it um c5 knight e6 bishop h2 rook d2 queen e6 is this material advantage worth it or no should we shoot king h2 I'm honestly not sure if this is worth it, Chad. <laughs> I think I'm simply gonna play bishop c8. I saw c5, bishop h2, but I'm just not sure if it's worth it. Since he will get he will get some crazy compensation, and I'm just not sure if that's good for me. Yeah, but now queen h5. I'm gonna go something like bishop h3. He would just get a monstrosity of a compensation. A rook and a bishop versus a queen and he would have good pawns. Maybe I'm better there, but it would be so difficult to play. Let's keep queens on the board and maybe checkmate him in under 40 moves, or, or even sooner. Or maybe it will be a long game. <laughs> we will see. Uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say. I have too many words to say, but now I suddenly don't. 95, this isn't this a free pawn? Or bishop h3 chat, look at this. Bishop h3. E d queen g4, how does he prevent that? Ah, knight h4, but now it is knight h4. G3 I take. So bishop h3, g h queen of 3, e d knight h4. He has king f1. And does he escape there? That's a question or not. And I'm not sure if I should try it and blitz. Since there isn't much time in the game. But it's tempting, you know, it's tempting, but okay, I think I'm just gonna simply win a pawn because I mean, a pawn is a pawn, plus I'm gonna have the two bishops advantage, so overall it's a very, very nice position. Even though it's a double pawn, I just have two bishops, and his king, I wouldn't say is the best piece, the safest piece. Let's go bishop d6. Knight e4, he does want to trade, but bishop h3, knight d6, queen g6, I want to take, and if gh, queen g6, knight g5, take. Hold on. I don't know, chat, if this is going to be good or not. I think it should be good, but I don't know. Yes. I don't want to spend half my time on one move. So it is, it will happen. Yeah, I don't know. What will happen will happen, I guess. It's our best, it is best to phrase it like that. What will happen will happen. If gh, I want to go queen g6, queen g4. If knight d6, I want to go queen g4, rook d6, something like that. Yeah, or queen g4, or queen g6 is better. Perhaps even queen g6. Since uh, I want to keep pressure on the c2 pawn and I want to have an escape escape way for the bishop. Uh, and now something like, I don't know, bishop e4 perhaps? Bishop e4, maybe f5. Here, rook d5. Or no, I don't know. Rook e6. Maybe let's go rook e6. Yeah, let's go rook e6 and like queen of 5 bishop d5. Uh, this, let's go queen of five is a threat of c5. Has to be careful, since any queen moves runs into c5. c5, what will he do? I don't know. g4, queen d5, f5. No, but g4 I can take on f4. Yeah, queen d5, f5, rook e8, rook h3, cd, queen h8, king f7, gosh, what's going on? Or should I simply take bishop f4 and then do something there? I don't know, but I'm gonna stop commenting. Try to concentrate more. Think this, this takes king f8, queen h8, queen g8. Should be okay. But it's gonna be a little scary. That's what I can say for sure. Maybe you can simply play, okay, it takes. I check. Queen d2, queen f4. Time. Uh, check. Ah, and if he goes to the d file, I have queen d6, and that's a queen trend. That's nice. And now I'm a piece up. 
I'm going to go king f7, h5, bishop f5. Or, yeah, he just resigns. Yeah, I'm happy with this game, chat. Hello, Zalmai. I'm very happy with this game. I think it was pretty smooth. Eighty-nine point eight. Oh, in a brilliancy. That's nice. Bri Bishop AC was a brilliancy. Yeah, I was worried that it wouldn't work. But okay, I could have simply kept the two bishops and tried to play that. But yeah, I mean, Bishop H three. You see that if your queen gets here, then it's a double attack. You win a knight. So you calculate that, and after queen c two, simply win a second one. And that's over C five, queen D five. Excellent. Okay, queen F four was a bit more smoother. I'm sure smooth is a word, but I think it is. Queen d1, check, 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 check. King d2, queen d6, yeah. That was a good game. And another brilliancy. Uh, yes, okay. I was... Yeah, okay, I should have played bishop g4 here. And after... No. What should I have I done? Okay, it's bishop g4, e5, take, 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 take. And I would simply be an exchange up. Yeah, okay, makes sense. Yeah, it did work indeed, that was nice. But after that, it was a good game. Here I was just interested... Okay, bishop g4 here, I think, was da too, oops, too dangerous. Yes, e5. I had equality, but it's some hard equality. Bishop e6, queen d2, rook d8, knight d4. Okay, c5 was better. And then, yes, this line... But I don't know, it felt a bit too complicated, since he has a rook and a bishop. Uh, he kind of might lose, maybe. I'm not sure, Jim, watch the game. I think it was practically difficult to play, so I decided not to go for it. I know he kind of drew, but he was lost, like really lost. Nice, nice window, or nice save. Oh yeah, nice tactic. Nice clutch from Higaro. Uh, but yes, after knight d4, bishop, bishop c8 was a miss, Stockfish says, but still practically it's incredibly hard to play for white. I have like four of my pieces in the attack, and I can include more. Yeah, we'll see about that. Top series difficult in title Tuesday. But we gotta hope. And then the game was played very well. Uh oh. Okay. Let's watch this game. Ooh. It should be a draw. But honestly, I think white are the one playing on a win, like knight f2, knight g4, knight h6. I don't know why they're being defensive. Yeah, black black pushed too far. If I'm not mistaken, knight f2 would simply win the game for white. Okay, it's zero zeros, but knight f2, knight g4, knight e5, or knight e6 would be super, super tricky. Uh, but yeah, the game should end in a draw. At the end of the day, I don't think black has any chances. So white, yeah, okay, it's some... Um, Threefold or fivefold repetition. And okay, next round, let's go. Okay, let's go with knight of three. Oh no. Now let's go knight of three. I played e4, let's try something new. Maybe next game I can play e4 as well. Just last game was fun. I, I messed it up a bit in the end game, but ooh, the end the middle game was super fun. C4. Okay, here I'm gonna go for g3. Let me see if I can recall the lines. Is it knight c2 here or no? Or knight, is it, I, eh, I, I forget whether it's knight c2 or it's knight f3. Knight f3 looks logical to me. Yeah, I think it is knight f3. Yes, d4 I cannot take a screen a5. So I think I think I castle. I think e3, there is d3. Try something like this. I'm not sure if including a3, a5 is good. And he has e4. Maybe I'm misplaying it. But we'll see. Because e3, d3. Perhaps I'm fine there, but I just forgot how to play it. That's why I didn't go for e3. Per, per, okay, maybe if a5 I will play e3, knight c3, since I have c5 square, maybe d5. Yeah, probably e3 was better, and he's thinking probably I stepped out of the book. 
I'm not sure what to do after e4. It's okay, we'll see. <laughs> we will see what I will do. Because I don't know what I will do. And hopefully I will know what to do. Or maybe I won't even play e4. <laughs> E4? I don't know. We'll see. I have h3 in case. E4, knight g5, bishop f5, b4, h6, b5. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. But okay, he's sinking for over a minute already. I got him out of book chat, I think. Either I'm losing it like two moves, or I got him out of book. Okay, now I think I can simply play e3, even though he has d3, so maybe not so simply. But I think e3 is fine, and maybe knight g5. Something like that. Since, okay, if he takes, I'm fine. If he plays d3, I will think. Maybe knight g5, maybe something else will come to my mind. Since knight g5, d3 hangs, and if bishop of 5 5 e4 with the idea to take on d3, he does go for d3 indeed. I'll play knight e1, but then e4, so I think I'm gonna go for knight g5. Bishop c5, so maybe I won't go for knight g5. I don't know why I'm talking too much, that much. I honestly do not know why I talk so much right now. But okay, I'll go knight c3. The idea after e4 to go knight g5, simply win the pawn. And now he has to prove that d3 is a strength and not the weakness. Uh huh. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay, first of all, knight g... No, but okay. I think I'm gonna go here. He takes. The 98, I don't know, 92, 94 or something like this? Or e4 even. e4, queen d3. Yeah, e4? Is there anything wrong with that? Or should I go 92 and transfer my knight? I think e4. And simply take the pawn. So perhaps DC wasn't a good idea. But yeah, he'll probably try something like castle, take, and then like f5, or something like this. Yeah, he does go for it. Knight d2 now, if takes, I'm gonna take if f4, knight c4. Yeah, if f3 simply takes, if not, I wanna go g, f, e5, d6, queen d5. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, 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 uh. GF, take, take, e5, bishop, e5, d6, queen, g5. Ensure this, this, and then I can... Hmm. I time is also running pretty low. Oh, here f3 bishop h3. The bishop is terrible there, but just get uh, don't get me wrong. I want to take bishop b4, and to keep my bishop terrible, he has to keep his bishop and his rook on protecting the pawn. And if he doesn't, then my bishop will be a beast. And now I think I simply win this pawn or no? I think I do. Take take knight g5 bishop g5. So now, my, my, from a terrible piece, my bishop simply won a pawn for me. And if knight g5, I have bishop g5. So the idea, if rook f3, okay, he goes here. Yeah, knight g5 can be tricky, so maybe I should simply remove my queen. Because I don't want to take just yet on d6, and also knight g5 is an idea. This queen c6, take take, knight d6, yes, this looks very nice. Rook b8, queen c6, take take, rook b2. He doesn't even take. Rook c1, my knight doesn't hang. Knight d6, this, this, so knight d6 he'll have to take. And that looks just fine. Um, yeah, queen c1, I have bishop c1. Thank you so much for the raid, Lula Robs. Thank you. 
Thank you for the rate. Welcome, readers. Hope you had an amazing stream. I am played in Title Tuesday. And so far, I'm on three out of uh, four. Thank you so much for the rate. Guys, go check Lula out. Thank you so, so much for the rate. Welcome, readers. Hello, Johnny D. Thank you. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Hope you had an amazing stream. Nice calculation. Thank you. I think it was a pretty smooth game as well. I probably messed up something in the opening. 96. Well, that's pretty suspicious. <laughs> um, okay, Knight of C is a book. Why did I have in my Knight C2? I honestly have zero idea why. Yeah, okay, D4. So, okay, Knight of C is correct. D4. Ah, it's E3 first. Oh, no. A3 was weird. Yes, it's E3 and after D3, I play Knight C3 and it's something strange. But I played A3, including A3, Bishop D6. Now e3, and yes, he ended up just losing a pawn. And then I got a terrible bishop, but he ended up losing a second pawn. <laughs> and then he ended up losing a third pawn, and then he just ended up blundering a queen tight That's a game. So I'm happy with this game. That was a very smooth game. Really, really nice. Yeah, last two games were really nice. This one didn't get a brilliancy, but 96 accuracy is 96 accuracy, you know? Um, so, last three games I got two brilliances in round two and three, and now 96 accuracy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, B6. White pawns. White pawns are promoting. Let me open the break timer just in case. So I don't waste the break break time on uh, opening the break timer, you know? Sounds super strange, but yeah, it is like that. This is a draw. I don't know. Let's watch this game, for example. Okay, what has happened? But, okay, black war pushing. Then they blundered king g2, no, king h2. With the threat of queen f4. Oh, look at this! King h2. The threat is queen f4. Ah, uh, no. Queen d2 is a move. Mm, I honestly not sure why it's 65. But yeah, black were pushing, white were winning, then white blundered, and a draw. That's how the game ended. Okay, this should be a win for white. Rook one, rook seven. King of seven, yeah. F six, king of eight, GG. Game over. Yeah. Let's see if there are any other games. Okay, ah, this is the final game of the round. Okay, fair enough. Okay, the move slagged out, but whenever we get a result. Okay, chat break, see you in a few minutes, about four or five. So enjoy the break, get some snacks, I'll be right back.
Hello everybody and I'm back. Still two minutes. Pretty early. So how are you doing guys today? Let's talk a bit before the round five. How how are you? How was today? Hopefully it was great. And we had 577 players today. Nice. See he carried did he okay he's on three and a half he just drew once Hans is on three and a half as well Uh-huh Uh-huh I will see who I'll get in round five Perhaps it's gonna be some GM or something because many strong people on three and a four Eh chess come load uh-huh but also many not so strong. I mean, okay, don't get me. I mean, not so strong, lower than like 20, I don't know, 2,500. There's plenty of people. Um, but yeah, it's going to be interesting to see who I'll get. Ah, uh, how many? Still 35 seconds. So in about 20 something seconds, okay, now 20 seconds, I'll turn on emote only because... It's better to turn it on and then prepare for the game for five minutes. Just gather your prep in five. Oh, five minutes. Oh my goodness. Five seconds, guys. It's really, 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 really uh, helps preparing. You know, you, you you quickly check your files in your head and then you play. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. I forgot. Wait, 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 give me five seconds. Okay, there is still five seconds. Okay, let me prepare quickly. Mm, okay, I'm ready. Okay, 2600, not at OGM, but still, let's not take it easy, and I'm getting double white! I am getting double white. Well, I'm not playing double white, I got double white. Because I'm playing double white, it's like double white is my opponent. But I got two whites in two games in a row. Can't castle by clicking the rook here. Okay. E four, bishop g five. Okay. E D E five, ninety five, take, take. Take, take, 95. I don't know. <laughs> Very deep calculations, and I'm not sure if they are necessary. Uh, mo most probably not. E5, but E5 is interesting. I'm just not sure if it's good to take, take. Okay, go C6. C6, so he'll take with the bishop, most likely. Okay, two bishops advantage? Sure. Honestly, why not? And he'll most likely take... No, he takes with the knight. Okay. Uh, bishop e2? I don't know. So you protect the g4 square. f4? 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 e5? Uh, f4 knight g6. Okay. g6 is a nice move. Uh, then let's, I guess, play queen to c2. Con connecting my rooks. I don't know why I cannot speak English. Last couple of streams. <laughs> um, okay, let's take the control over the open file. I'll probably play either rook f or rook a to d8. Uh, f3 maybe. To get my bishop to the other diagonal. I don't know. e5 also may be interesting with knight e4, then bishop f5. Gotta play faster, that for sure. Let's play bishop d3 with the idea of e5. Missing knight h5, unfortunately. So I won't have my two bishops advantage no more. It was a very, very, very dubious move. Very, very dubious. But maybe I can play e5 and have to take, take, get more space? I don't know. 
but you always got to look for positive in things so maybe that's one positive e5 what will he play bishop b3 uh-huh so yeah e5 probably isn't good uh Then let's go queen e2 pre preventing knight h5 idea since queen protects square okay rook d2 he can take the pawn but i don't really think i should care that much about it because i'll have some e5 e6 ideas <sighs> and i think d2 is the best square for the rook in the current situation e5 i want to take the knight Trying to ruin his pawn structure. Let's take a quick sip of water. Knight d5, bishop g6, fg, knight e4. Ah, nice move. Very nice move from my opponent. I missed that completely. Mm, very nice. g3 f4 perhaps but nice nice knight f4 yeah because i think otherwise i'm simply better that's a nice move queen of five is the idea Queen of five isn't yeah an idea because he has bishop e six. Okay, rook e three. If ninety five, rook e four. Idea. Queen e5, wow, okay. I didn't think that he'd go here, but he wants to take on e5, I suppose. Let's go e6. Queen h6 ideas, queen g6 as well. What a move. Wow. It's a really nice move from my opponent. Ay, ay, ay. Ah. Wow. That was a brilliant move. Ah, I completely missed it.
Swindle! <laughs> oh my goodness, what a game! Ooh, ooh. I, 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 why would he play c5 before e5? Why did he play c5 e4 b5? When I have a light square bishop? <laughs> what a game! Okay, I got the brilliant. Bishop C4 was a brilliancy some. No, but I thought Bishop C4 from him was a brilliancy. What a move. I thought I'm completely winning. But Bishop C4. And gosh, what do I play? Bishop C4, brilliancy, Queen E6. Queen D6 was a miss. I had to take and then play this position, which is super unclear. I, I Yeah, I don't know. I'm, yeah, I miss Queen F7. Then he's completely won. Why did he play B4, C5? I don't know. And then he was short on time. I somehow managed to get some magical counterplay. I don't know what the rook b6, I would simply be completely lost, no chances. He played king e4, h5, and then I somehow promoted. I don't know what. What was this game? I don't know, Chad. That was a ridiculous game, but a win is a win. Thank you so much, Miss Gifter, for giving a team once up to Dubious Apple, and thank you guys. Thank you guys for the nice words. That was a crazy game. Whew. Yeah, White should have simply played Bishop H6, King H2. Hi, Surfing Venice. Hi. Hello. Magical counterplay. Thank you, Lord Lorgan. That was something crazy indeed. Whew. Yeah, I mean, I saw like, okay, Rook B6. Okay, I cannot even promote the pawn, but then BAM! Win it. <laughs> Whew. Ah, okay, it's round it's already starting. Okay, probably some GM. I guess. I don't know. Robert beat Carlson. Whoa! That is... That is nice. Yeah, I saw he played H4 Karakan. I didn't see anything since. Uh, I turned the team on. Yes, I did. Uh, yeah, I just seen that they got Karakan. E4, C6. Boom, boom, boom. H4. Since that, I have seen absolutely nothing. Nice for Robert. Well done. My opponent's name is Speed of Light. So I suppose <laughs> I shouldn't get in time troubles with him. <laughs> because the Speed of Light is pretty fast. If you aren't aware, you know. Uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure you are aware that speed of light is pretty fast. Bishop H3, maybe. <coughs> maybe F5, F4. It looks a little suspicious, though. Maybe Queen G6, Bishop G4. Oh, that looks in more. Ah, but then, but then, but then, Knight B6 is an option. Uh, 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 <coughs> five Queen, yeah, Queen C3. Not sure. Bishop G4, Bishop G4, take, take. Yeah, we have weak light squares. Perhaps it's not the best thing, but let's try it. And then maybe then f5, f4 can be an idea. <sighs> 20 seconds may be a bit too much to think about one move. Probably it is, but okay. 
And now f5 f4 looks interesting in my opinion. Let's try it. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out, you know. It's life. Rook e7, f4. What is he planning? Queen b4 or something? Queen b4, maybe queen f6. So the rook is hanging f take g. Ah, he goes queen c7. But okay, queen f6 anyways. Is the idea of fg. And queen f4, queen e7. Maybe the second exchange? I don't know. I doubt it. But we'll see. Maybe. Ah, yeah, rook e1 is an option. Rook e1, knight f2. Is there anything there with this piece sack? Or is it. Worthless, I don't know. But okay, rookie one f f g queen f two rook f two. Something like that, at least winning a pawn. Okay, rookie one take the take rook f two. Is this any good? Just Interesting move with the idea of FG. I think I'll simply do this and take. <coughs> yep. Let's go look at fate. Yeah, now King H8. Is the idea of rook f1, knight e3, if he takes, so that I have rook h1, rook g1, or something like that, I think, should work. Check and then h5. And mate? Ah, no, that's not mate. Oops. But okay, check, check. Okay, I think at least I should. Ah, no, but okay, wait, wait, wait. What am I doing? This is, this is just mate. Maybe a mate in it? So I don't see a way. Any slow on time. But it's a speed of light, so, you know, time trouble, it's still... Okay, how does he, how does he protect? It's just me. Let's go! Let's go! That was a smooth game! Oh, F5, what an idea! That was so nice! Yeah, the, yeah, 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 yeah! 90.2 Okay, I was slightly better here. Bishop g4 was a mistake. I was better again. Was knight e3 better? Ah, queen e4. Ah, the knight is hanging. This is hanging. Left takes Jesus red. Thank you, I have. Yeah, so queen v6 is simply winning knight. <laughs> or fg and or fg and I win the knight. But okay, this is this I won a pawn. And yes, there was a mistake. King h8 was such a nice move. I feel like okay. Stockfish says better was check check h5 and then king f8, but I don't know, king h8? And yeah, knight b6 was just a blunder, then the mate is worth. That was a great game, nice. And fortunately, we didn't get into in time trouble, because then then my chances would be quite low against the speed of light. Yeah, nice, that was a nice mating, mating net indeed. Yeah, that is true, that is true, that is true. <laughs> How do you get infinite energy is a question. I thought f5 maybe is easier. f5, f5, e6. Yeah, now 
Now White is playing for the win because e6. Whew, whew. Okay, two. Infant coffee. True. True. Okay, rook e3, rook a7. Sing blue bomb loses. G7 and then h yeah, king h6, king of six, g5. White has to be careful. This and then rook b ah g6. Ah. It's winning, it is winning, but oof. Feels a little shaky. Thank you, Frogger. Yeah, that was smooth. Stockfish doesn't agree because I had queen d4, which I missed. But I thought, okay, I mean, a pawn, a pawn is a pawn, you know, an extra pawn is an extra pawn. And what else? Bishop d4 was a mistake. But I honestly didn't check why it's a mistake. But practically, practically, bishop d4 with f5, f4 idea, I feel like it's a good. It's a good uh, practical way to play. Hikaru is playing. I oh, know he was playing. Okay. Yeah, black wins. Isn't too entertaining. Okay, this should be winning for white, but still a little bit tricky. Rook b three and now rook b two. Yes, now rook b2 is unstoppable, and the idea king d3, king b3, king d4, this is winning. Rook b2, like can resign, since the king. a4, even nicer. The king is not in the square. You can draw an invisible square, and this you can see that the king isn't in it. And yeah, white just won. Well done. Yeah, three people are on six out of six. Wow. Oh, take care, Andy. Thanks for joining in and thanks for 65 months at tier 2. May the forks be with you. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Hopefully they will the forks will be with me indeed. Take care and bye bye. Okay, let's see how many how many predictions can I predict? Buddy, go to Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I got two one. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, emote only. Thank you so much, Andy, for 49 bits. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, I mean, is there anybody else I can play except Joe's Pepper Title Tuesdays? <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's like my seventh game against Jospam. I am so lucky you and getting Jospam in title to use each other, that's insane. Like, uh, I don't know teamwork only, yeah? But it's like, every title Tuesday I'm playing Jospam. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> I think I played Jospam the most amount of times. This is out of any players I played Title Tuesday against in Title Tuesday against, and Jospem is probably top four, top one, with quite quite a lead, you know. I think this is like seventh or eighth game against him, and most of the games I'm getting up with Black. That's interesting. But okay, I defeated him before, so let's let's do it again. <laughs> Ah, queen b7. That keeps the queen still, I think. Oh no, should I trade them? Four, ay ay ay. Maybe I should play King of Eight first. <clears throat> a G six still isn't a good option. And loses a pawn. Ay 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 ay. Um. I don't know why I played bishops hate honestly. Because after if he would play f5 that would be forced, but what's what is the point now? Honestly don't know. Okay, if he takes then there was some use. If he doesn't and plays like rookie five, then it was a worthless move pretty much. 
But okay, maybe after rookie five I can take take knight d seven or something like this. I don't know. He's thinking. That's super unusual when you have more time against Josephine. <laughs> uh it's super unusual and super rare. Ninety seven I wanna because this knight is super annoying on C five, so I wanna get rid of it. Let's try to. Okay, but now bishop b seven. I wanna take take rook e eight and c five. Maybe c5 earlier was better. If knight c5, we want to take, take bishop c8. Ah, yeah, I cannot take. Ah, knight d7, this is nasty. Bishop c8. Yeah, that's a little miscalculation. Is it gonna take? Give me seven. To develop my bishop, but then g4 is it's 18, I suppose. Maybe let's go here, bishop d5, id, I don't know. Maybe it wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Wow. Wow. Oh dear. Time. I was up on time, but ah, uh, just by me so fast in the end games. Try at least something to push some passers. No, I just have one. It's not even a passer, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> Okay. 
Yeah, king g5. Rook c7, f6, I guess. Yeah. That, I, I don't know, I feel like he was close, but then this king d6. Really nice maneuver from him. GG. Okay, I don't know chat, it felt super close at one point, but then this king d6 and oof, really nice move. See the accuracy. I missed, yeah, I thought maybe 6 equalized, but then knight c5. Uh, I was doing fine. Bishop e6, okay, bishop e6 was a mistake, then it wasn't good already. I should have somehow tried to stay here. And yeah, I guess it's like king d7, king c7. Do not let the king go to d6. But still, this is this rook a6. I sack and okay, yeah. Yeah, and then it wasn't good. GG. Hmm. And this game ended right when I was opening it, it just ended. Okay, let's watch this game. Ooh! If the rooks are gonna get traded, then it's a dead theoretical draw. But black still has to trade the rooks, you know? Okay, not blunder. Trade the rooks. And white misses the rook hanging. Oh my goodness. I mean, Sophie says it's made in 6. Okay, now king g6, it's over. Ah! Chad, this is so tricky! This is so tricky, it should be completely winning for white, but how do you win this? You have to go king, I think king g5, triangulation. White flagged! Woo! <laughs> wow! What a swindle from black! <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness, okay, let's go chat. Wow, but black got incredibly lucky. Thank you so much, NGMW for seven with Prime. Thank you. Thank you so so much. Welcome to the channel. Uh, what is this chat? Ugh. I don't know key four. Oh my goodness! <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Um, with h6 g5. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's go c3 protecting the pawn. Unusual stuff. I, should, I may I, I may say, queen b3. Isn't this a pawn? No, I, 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 I wouldn't be surprised of anything, chat. I wouldn't be surprised if it's a prep. I wouldn't be surprised if it's a blunder. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, that's a pawn, right? I think so, unless I am... No, but I'm gonna take... And I'm gonna take... That's a second pawn, if I can count. And then I'll go queen a4. He doesn't have knight b6 since a pin. What is going on? Okay, bishop b5, bishop d7 idea. Yeah. h4. Just opening up the the side so he cannot castle. Because I can play like knight d2 and then long side castle. Maybe h4 was a bit too quick. Maybe I should have let him castle first and then open, open up the play with h4. He made castle, honestly. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised at all if you would castle right now. But so far I think it's wow. Uh we're just saying I think it's two extra pawns. Knight of five is a nice move. This game is very, very <laughs> unusual and strange, yet interesting at the same time. I 
of h5 when I go bishop g5. Yes, now I was thinking to take if this rook g7, if not just knight d2 and castle it and, and then just say bye bye. <laughs> But okay, honestly, okay, rook g1, queen g4, king e2, queen h2, king d3! <laughs> is this a nasty little square for my king, huh? Uh huh. And king d3! <laughs> How are you gonna reach it? Ah. <laughs> uh, uh huh. I made them two pawns up, no? I don't see compensation still. And I can go king d3, rook g1, king c2, king b1. <laughs> Okay, goes bishop h6. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe rook e1 is a bit better. Or maybe let's go king d3 immediately. I don't know, queen f2 there. No, let's go rook e1. And then king d3. Yes, he wants to go with like king e7, rook b8. Something like that. So what, 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 what else should he do to create something? Okay, king d I mean, I can go king d1 even. But I don't know, I like d3 more. <laughs> because king d1 there is bishop e3. Um, yeah. Interesting. Let's go rook h1. Ah, h5 is hanging. Hold on, rook e2 and then h5 is hanging. Then I think I'm gonna take first and then take h5. Because I don't know, knight can jump to f6 or b6, but now he cannot. Three pawns, he cannot move the rook since the bishop falls. King of d3 is chilling, you know? <laughs> <laughs> quite quite an unusual square for a king to chill on, but it looks like it's chilling. Okay, rook b5. And rook b5, rook b8. I need c Okay, let's go king c2. King is chilling on d3, but let's, let's, I don't know. Rook b5, I didn't like rook b8. But that's good that he doesn't have this annoying outside passer on h5 no more. Queen c6. Rook d7 feels like it's necessary. Gonna take and on lights on the light squares he can only attack me with his queen. Maybe rook g2 is stronger, but let's play queen g2 because if it's a queen trade, he has nothing absolutely. So let's go for a queen trade. Okay. Now my light square is in weak. Now my king is a strength. And I have three extra pawns for which he needs to prove his compensation, and I honestly doubt that he has any. And then I want to go rook d2 in some mating patterns, perhaps. Or rook g8 so that his bishop is paralyzed and then start pushing the pawns. Yeah, b4, c4, a3, c5, king c3. I have to be careful about stalemate. Here, here, rook d2. No straightening mate from the other side. And he flagged. Acha, that was a strange game. I mean, it felt like I was completely winded out of the opening. But what an opening we had. 1a6, 2g5. I, I don't know what happened in this game. <laughs> it's very confusing. 90.9. Okay, I was completely winning pretty much for the whole game.
Yeah, okay, Bishop G4 was just a mistake. Queen B3. I got two pawns. Then H5 allowed the move. I was thinking rook g7 is interesting, but after rook g7, some queen h4 or some queen f6 felt like he might get some compensation. So I decided to simply take f takes c, and my king was completely chilling on d3 for like half of the game, and then decided to chill on c2, and then yeah, just e5, queen trade, and yeah. But that was a strange game. <laughs> because of the how the opening was played, honestly. After I think I played smoothly, so there was nothing too too strange, but uh, the opening was very strange. <laughs> ah, it should be winning for black. But black still has to win it. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is over. Bishop, uh, king of four. Yup, well played. Ah, so what? Wow, black sack tonight. Wow, now they're completely winning. This is really nasty. And now rook did one. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Just wow. Wait, chat. This is round eight. Huh? Oh, this is round eight already. Chad, I thought this is round 7, hello! Ah! When did I play round... what? I forgot about this crazy game! I thought the game against Speed of Life was a uh, game after the break. Sheesh! <laughs> I completely forgot! Oh my goodness! I would be like, Sijin, oh, why doesn't the round start? <laughs> and then it's round 8 out of 11! <laughs> oh, that's funny. It is actually funny. Okay, draw in the final game of the round. Should be a draw. Aha! So it's a break this round. Cool. Okay, this game will probably last for a, quite, quite a while. Like Mayfly? I don't know. Whew. Yeah, but I feel like it was another smooth game. 19.9 from Stockfish, but I mean, I was winning pretty much as it said by itself that I was winning for pretty much the whole game. 2000 years later. Yeah. And it's still going. Oh, I know, but one eternity is much less than uh, 2000 years. So. Yeah. 20 eternities later. Hold on! Is eternity a century or eternity isn't even a real like number? Chat, help me out. Etern it's not a set. It's uh, eternity is just like a long time, but it's not specified amount of time, right? Or am I wrong? Correct me if I'm wrong. It love to know. It's not a real number. It's a principle. Okay, thank you. Okay, draw finally. Chat break time, I need to refill my water. See you in a couple of minutes. Take care, everybody.
Hello everybody. I got my water. Eternity is like forever, yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Eternity is forever. So, 20 eternities is much more than 2,000 years. <laughs> So let's let's not let's hope there won't be a game which lasts for twenty eternities, guys. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's not gonna be fun to watch, will it? <laughs> okay, still a minute till round nine. Yeah, I don't know. I thought it was just round seven. I was like, I'm on six out of seven. I completely forgot that I had two losses already. <laughs> yeah, fun. Okay, Firuja is seven and a half, and a lot of people with seven, a lot of people with six and a half, and a lot of people with six as well. Not so many people. Yeah, but okay, it's not so many people. Honestly, with six or six and a half or seven. With five and a half on the other end. Also not so many. With five on the other end. There is much more. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, 25, 1 and 20 is same like 20. That is true, 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 true. <laughs> Very true. <laughs> All right, chat, emotes only. So 1 eternity is the same as 100 eternities, makes sense. Okay, okay, I can close the break timer because I will need it. Okay. Okay, chat. That's int very interesting. Okay. Should be six. Okay, eight. Seems like this is an idea, I think. Okay, let's play h6, bishop h4, g5. Ah, uh, no, this probably isn't good. Okay. G5, take, 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 bishop, G5, king, G7. Uh, is this good there? Queen of three, rook, H, rook, H8. Come on, I gotta move. G5, take, take, this. Okay, whatever, let's go for it. Gotta play faster. Okay, it didn't take. Uh, this is this. Ninety five takes. Ninety six takes. Take, take, take. Okay, let's go knight of four. Maybe G4 was stronger though. See, maybe G takes F will be better. Or Queen F4. Queen F4 has G4 in mind and F5 in mind as well. Okay. 
page three. Let's go G4, I think. It's more interesting to open up the play because bishop h3 may work, but I don't think it does work. Knight f5, I want to play knight e7. Trading the knight away, and if bishop f4, okay, he takes bishop f4 immediately. Okay. I, I just gotta hurry up <laughs> and stop thinking. Okay, rook six, knight seven, knight g rook g six is this skin of eight ninety seven. I gotta play much faster. Okay. Here. My bishop, I want to move it. Gotta play faster. Why am I thinking for so much? Okay. Number D
yeah okay i don't know maybe i was better but okay a draw is a draw anyways Whew. all right maybe i was better but i feel like i was worse i was playing no i think i was better here somewhere Knight e3, I was plus one. Knight h3 actually was the best move. Knight e3, bishop e3, knight g5, okay. I was better in the middle game. Then I was a bit worse. But then I managed to equalize and then it was a draw. Okay. Okay. You said let's play g4? What? g4 there, right? Ah, and G4 was a mistake as well. <laughs> okay. Mm. Right, gotta prepare more. Thank you so much, James Gifter, for gifted tier ones up to you on Novice. Yeah, pretty smooth game. 96, 95.9. Okay. Okay. Ah, emote only chat. Almost forgot. Oh my goodness. And two blacks in a row against GMs. Okay. Okay. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> um. I mean, the best thing in chess is to castle, right? <laughs> I, mean, I think so. Ninety-six, e four. That looks a tad bit scary, chat. Okay, castle. At least like h seven. Hopefully, will be a big weakness. I'm not sure about this pawn sack. Uh, Queen e5. Yeah, I think probably I maybe could have won the previous game if I was... If I was playing faster. I saw for too much in the opening. I was too worried about 95, but yeah, and I ended up just getting a better position. And I saw for too much, so I didn't have too, too much time to think about how to materialize the advantage to materialize the material advantage sounds sounds <laughs> weird but yeah yes rook d4 Hmm. Yes, this doesn't look too too great. Um, let's go rook b8. Maybe keeping in mind some some b4. But I think I might be getting mated first. <laughs> Oops. Rook g1 looks a bit concerning, you know, just that bit concerning. Rook g1, g6, queen h6. Oof. Okay, 96. Just take, please. Just take, or don't take, and I'll get b4. Maybe something out of this b4. Ah! Take, take, rook d7. Okay, knight d4. Okay, b3, a3. I don't want to go with rook g1, I want to go g6. Ah, bloody rook d4. Chat, what was this game? That was bad. <laughs> Yeah, just rook d4. What do I do? Okay, gotta try. Ah! Yes, bishop f7. Oh my goodness, child. That, that was... That was a really... Really... It's still playable. Ah, no, it's not. Oh. That was not a good game. <laughs> Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. 
and that wasn't good at all. Yeah, first I lost a point, then I lost the game pretty much. <laughs> In a matter of like 10 moves or something. Well, that escalated pretty quickly. <laughs> ah, okay. Ah no, my, my pawn! That was my only hope! That he somehow would move the rook and a back rank mate, but he took my, my final, my last hope. But okay, f6 still. Never give up, chat. Let's try to create some inconveniences for my opponent, so it won't be that, that easy for him to realize the advantage. Unlikely that I'll create something, but I mean, gotta try. Yeah, it's just a good goodies we just a quick trade. <laughs> that also escalated very quickly from me trying to try something to my tries. Uh, yeah, that wasn't good. I gotta check how you play this line. Because I know how to play against uh, f3, e4, but I completely forgot how to play this line. Let's check. Knight c3. I mean, okay, taken should be a must. D. Why did I play d6, right? Huh? d6, castle. Yes, no, I saw this, but then bishop d6. And then you take, take queen a5. And then there is g4. Ah, uh, interesting. Ah, uh, emote, no, but I turned it. Ah, no, I didn't turn it. Oh, good. I didn't turn off emote only. So d6 is the best move. Didn't he have bishop f7? Where? I mean, he had, if I would take cd, he would. Castle knight c6. Take. 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 Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I played bishop e7. And then I just got a worse position. I should have tried something like queen e5, but I ended up just being a pawn down. Bishop e6 gave... Ah! Bishop e6 gave equality since take, take, a2 and f4 hangs. So bishop e6... Bishop d5, queen a4, it's, it's, or c4, okay. I played bishop f3, and then I just lost pretty much. <laughs> yeah, after knight d4, he took on d4, and cd, bishop f7. <laughs> ah, he reported again. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, he got against blue bomb. That's, that's a battle of titans. Okay, what do you mean? Do you do any bits with channel points? Yeah, yeah, yeah! If you have channel points, you can either buy a game with me for 10k, either I can analyze any of your games when you send me a link to it or like something. Uh, you can show me the game, I'll analyze it for 10k. For 12k, you can play 2 nil. For three, uh, for 15k, we can play 3 nil. Then for 20k, you can suggest an opening for the next game I play. Then for 20.5, but okay, let's turn it down to 20. You can play Duck Chess. And uh, for 50k, you can play you, a 5 plus 0 blindfolded game while I'm being blindfolded and you aren't. <laughs> yeah, content indeed. Oh, what a move! 95, that's nasty. <laughs> twice, chat, twice. Out of two titles, you say two reports. When Firuja is losing, that's a huge game for the top one. Firuja loses it. Ugh. Yeah, Blue Bomb lost, unfortunately. Hans, let's watch Hans. Hans is holding, I think. Queen g6, tricky. I mean, it's tricky to hold in time trouble, but I guess Hans should hold it. King g8. 
Нет, дро. Окей. Окей, чат, final round. Let's forget what happened in the previous game. And let's get a good final round. You know? I mean, since happen. I messed up the opening completely. Uh, but, yeah. Let's, let's just hope for a good final round. What a blunder from white. <laughs> Emo. But it's still not the... No, no, e Logan, thank you, but it's still not the round. We're still watching games. Thank you for reminding, but... Uh, but, yeah, when, when, yeah, thanks for reminding. The game still hasn't started yet. But I should get white, since I got two blacks in a row, I should get white. And white is fun. Good luck, thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Lorgan. Bortnik is worse, but likely, I think it's likely that he'll hold it. Or maybe not. I'm not sure. Probably not. Yeah, probably Bortnik will not hold it, but still, you know, anything can happen. Ah! Did I jinx it? Did I jinx it? I think I jinxed it. Oh! Or did I un- or did I jinx it without jinxing it? <laughs> King B4? King C5. It's super hard for black to win. They are completely win, but they're super low on time. King E4. King D3. Bishop D5. D3. How do you win this? I mean, I guess something like B2. Yeah. Knight of one, king e two. Knight of knight g three, king of three. It's resignable, I think. Okay, wait, knight e two. How do you play after knight e two? Bishop a two, I suppose. And knight g three, king of three now. Ah, tricky. King of king e one, just king e one. Is it gonna be three fold actually? <laughs> Bishop a two resigns. Yeah, unlikely they will be three fold. King of two. Should be over. And it is over. Okay, chat. Now I'll turn it emote. Uh, turn on emote only. Okay, chat. Final round. Let's go. Come on. Shouldn't be. Should be white, I think. Hopefully, no three blacks in a row. Okay, and let's go. <laughs> ah, Mish to Lich's castle and with just tapping the rook. I think I just gotta play faster than, than in the game where I drew. I wanna take and then take GF and then get my king on G2. I feel like that's gonna be pretty nice. And that's like one of the only choices I have. <laughs> But I also like playing these positions. Pawn structure may not be the best, but it's interesting. Okay, goes rook e8. <clears throat> Let's go bishop f5. So I'm like giving him a choice whether he takes on f5. And then I already understand that there is nothing to worry about some bishop f3 stuff because it's not just going to happen. Okay, he does take on f5. It's just, just to get some clarity in the position, you know. Let's <clears throat> go so knight d2. Queen f3, 
Honestly, I would love to play e4, take, take, then you'd get g6, queen d7, queen d7, knight f6, some idea. But, okay, here perhaps rook d1, e4 can be interesting as well. Yeah, let's probably start with rook d1. e4 was an interesting idea, but I'll, I prefer to start with rook d1. Uh, he'll get queen d5 at the end of the line. So maybe, I don't know, let's play just a3 so that my pawn won't hang. And just to see what he does, because I mean, my idea is e4, so he should be worried about it. Uh huh. At least I hope that he, he should be worried about it. <laughs> okay, let's go b4, because why not? Maybe knight b3, maybe I can switch plans. I think another good scene, even if I'm too scared, I have queen f4 with a queen trade. Just in case. Maybe I should trade the queens now and try to win there in the endgame? I don't know, because e4, I don't know if it's too promising there. Yeah, let's try that. And then like knight b3, knight c5, something like that. Mm, yeah, I think g takes f is going to be good because e takes f. Rook trade, d4 will be a weakness. Okay, he doesn't want to trade the queens. Then let's try queen c7. Oh no. Let's try queen 7 knight of 3. So in case he goes for some g4 stuff, h4 stuff, I have knight f3. Looks interesting, this looks interesting as well. E4, take, 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 take. No, let's go knight of three. Uh, queen a5 or queen f4? Queen f4, queen h4. Strange position for my queen, but I honestly like it. Since I may have some g4 stuff. Okay, e4 isn't possible now. He moved the knight. It's not great. Ah, uh, yeah, ninety six. Very nice move, which I missed. Give him time to to improve his position while I am just pretty much standing on the same sp space, pretty much. I might go like a for b five, since I I need to create something, but I didn't I don't know what. Just to at least make him think, because I mean in time travel people blunder. Okay, queen h4 or queen g5. Hold on, queen g5. Yeah, let's go queen g5. Since okay, rook f5, I'm happy with a queen trade, and I'll have queen h4 if I really need to. Okay, e4. This is. Let's go b5. Bc. Did I trap my own queen? <laughs> I have knight d5, so I'll get some compensation at least. Uh, but yeah, my queen. Uh, 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 uh. Queen f4, queen e5 somehow. If knight e6, queen e5. Scuffed. <laughs> Very scuffed. Okay, now queen h4, I think. Not the best position for the queen, but I have g4 in mind. It's so like knight f3, knight e5, g4, or maybe e4. We'll see. If knight e6, okay, knight f3 preventing knight g5. g4. Queen 
queen f4, queen h2 if knight g4, queen g3, knight, ah, maybe queen e5 was stronger. Let's get my knight over to f4, yeah. The knight's away. C6 is a weakness, which I'm hopefully going to target. Rook C1. Here. Rook A2. Rook A7. And this is a blunder. And this is a bigger blunder. <sighs> Goodness me, that was a close game. My queen was so, so clumsy. Oh, Ooh. seven and a half. Nice. 90.3. Okay, I was worse. Yes, I was lost. Somehow I did, my queen didn't get trapped. It escaped through h3. And then, yes, I was the one who is pushing and I have more time and then end up winning. Seven and a half. Nice result. Thanks, Frogger. You're welcome. And I picked today as well, 2872. So right now I'm sitting 2869. Only terrible game was uh, round 10. 68 accuracy was bad. Round 1, I mean, round 1 was okay. It was okay ish. The other games were great. Brilliancy here, brilliancy here, here 96. Here, that was clumsy, but I swindled like crazy, then beat a 3060 GM, lost to Jospam, won 91 accuracy, didn't give any chances, and a good draw, bad game, and then a nice game as well. Whew. Nice, nice, nice chat, that was fun. That was fun. This should be a draw. King c3, knight f4, knight d3. Nice way to force a draw. Okay. So there's people sharing top one, Hikaru sharing top four. Is there much more games left or not really? Okay, just four games. Should be a win. No, but you have to get your bishop to d6. Just have to get bishop d6. I don't know how to win it as black. No, but h2 just wins, no? Just get your bishop to b8! Come on! Get this bishop on this diagonal! No! Rook d2. That's over. Yeah, bishop had to be on this diagonal. How do you win? King f3? Right now, no. Not at the moment, Frogger, but sometimes I am doing. Before I was doing, now it's... And white actually flag black crazy. Since it's not super safe to stream right now and I didn't have electricity for 7 hours today, 6 hours tomorrow, it's not super safe to stream, so... So far, right now I'm just doing Tidal Tuesdays, but maybe, maybe, unlikely, but hopefully I will add more streams, but we will we'll just leave and see. Okay, 7, now, I mean, okay, it is still a draw, but... <laughs> Black will be the one playing for a win. Okay, this is probably the final game of the tournament. No, because the 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 electrician stations got bombed, so now now there is no electricity, so we get electricity for some time, then we don't have it, it's like that. Oh uh, yeah, this should be a draw. So let's see, am I in top fifty? I hope I am. Maybe top 40, maybe top 60, I don't know, but I think about top fi around top 50. Thanks, Roger, take care. Thank you for watching. Let's see. 45th? That's nice, top uh, top 50. That's good, I'm happy. I'm happy I was sharing top 33, so I'm pretty happy. Sharing top 33? Yeah, pretty good tournament. I did bad tiebreaker, super. I mean, okay, I lost round one. So that's understandable by a terrible tiebreaker. But yeah, still, 45.
pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, chat, so that's pretty much it for today. Great stream, hope you enjoyed it as well. Thank you so, so much for for watching and everybody for the support. Thank you, anyways, Gifter for gifting tier one sub to Elon Novis and you, MW, for subbing with Prime. Andy for 49 bits at 65 months at tier 2. And he was gifted a gift at tier 1 sub to Dubious Apple. Lula Robs with a raid with a party of 65. And everybody for following. Also to Dania for subbing with Prime three days ago. Thanks everybody for watching. Hope you had an amazing time. Thank you so, so much everybody for watching. Bye to Bletchy, bye Karma, bye Pookie, bye Frogger, bye Lorgan, bye Vihaven, bye Eon Novis, bye Titanium Classics, bye... Ripoon, bye bye, show me the speed by MGMK for Y, bye 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 bye, to Bletchy by Gucci Pigeon, bye uh, Alex Soller, bye bye Andy, by Vibe Half Chess, by Shogunon, by Hanson614, by Giza Chess, by Surfing Venice, by Jeff Morris, bye bye everybody, bye Zalmai, bye Turkey Farm, bye everybody, hi Zavori and bye bye. Take care everybody, I'm sorry if I missed some, hope you had an amazing day and I hope to see you next time. Take care everybody and bye bye.